Hi everybody, it's me, Hannah, and that's, mm, that's my minion right there. And right now I'm in my room, and I'm going to show you guys my lip balm collection. So I got all my lip balms in this box, jewelry box. I like this jewelry box because of the rose on top and the cute vintage handle and all of the jewels and how it's designed. And the little legs, they look like roses. So let's just open this up. And check out my lip balms. First, I got this Dylan's candy bar, and it's cherry, and it smells. It smells really good. It smells like cherries, and I got it from Claire's. I really like the design because blue is my favorite color, and it has blue right here. And this is. It doesn't really show up that much. It just has a nice gloss. This one I made. I made it out of um, crayons and um, coconut oil, and I made a bunch of these. And I'm going to be uploading a video soon on how to make those, so yeah. And this is a purplish reddish, and this kind of shows, and it's kind of hard, so you have to pick it up by your nail and put it on. Just smear it on with your finger. And it shows really well. I also got this Mountain Dew that I got from Claire's and it's broken. I guess I could just put on like this. It doesn't really show and it's kind of cakey and it cakes on, see? And it's not, doesn't really look good for um, public, but it's good to wear around home because it really moisturizes my lips. Next is this really cute tiny one that I can hold and it shows kind of well if you put it on a lot. I wear this like to the grocery store or something like that because it's kind of formal. It's not really formal but it's like a casual everyday kind of lipstick and I wear it to school and I wear it all the time. It's another one I made and the ones I make are in these kind of container things that I got from the dollar store and um, this is kind of a corally watermelon -y color and it's really pretty doesn't show that well though but it looks really pretty on the here next is this NYC lipstick and um, my cousin used it um, a lot of times and she broke it but I managed to put it back in and now she made it look all dirty and stuff so it's still sufficient to use and it's really pretty color it's like a shiny pink color and I wear it to special occasions like weddings and stuff like that next is this ugly color I mixed red and orange and it looks bad but it looks like bad on the outside because it's all smearing stuff but if you put it on it looks nice it looks ruby red and it is really pretty and i don't really wear this anywhere i just wear it around the house because um i think it's too flashy for my age so next is this pink lemonade lip gloss that I got from Claire's and this one is so pretty um you put this on top of your lipstick or you put it under your lipstick to keep on cracking and it's um it smells so good and it tastes good and yeah and it smells like pink lemonade and it's so glossy and glittery you could put it over anything or under anything because it's a really good lip moisturizer now, this tube looks really weird, and trust me, it is lip gloss. It's this pink glittery-ish lip gloss, and it's really pretty. See this? And it smells good, too. I don't know what it smells like, though. Next is this, like, really purple lipstick. This is what it looks like. I use it a lot, and I accidentally messed with it, and it went... And this one's really flashy. See? Okay. Yeesh. 
I do not wear this anywhere. I just put it on for fun and pretend I'm a witch. Now this is um, the second last one that I made. It is, this is my favorite color. It looks like a bow or rose because roses are my favorite flower. As you can tell by the jewelry box and and just put on. It looks really pretty. I wear this to special occasions like um, the mall or the store and it's just casual lipstick and I don't really put too much on because it looks too dark if I put too much on. What I made is this bubblegum pink color and it's really pretty. But it doesn't really show well. Like the coral ones, so they have to put a lot on. And it's kind of hard because it will look all cakey and gross. But I manage. Now another one is this double-sided what? Is this double-sided lip gloss and this one is kind of like this one. And it's really pretty and as you can see I'm almost out of it. And it's fun to put on and just fun to wear like any place. Any party and it tastes good. <laughs> And on the other side is this cupcake. The camera cut me off. This is um, a cupcake kind of frosting color lip gloss. And you put it on top of this color. And I really like the idea of that because it doesn't show the color. It shows the sparkle. And you can see this from like a mile away and I don't use it that much. Because I'm afraid I'm going to waste it and I don't want to waste it. And it's really pretty. Next is this purple Monster High um, lip crown. And I got it from Toys R Us from, from someone. And it, this one shows, but I like to outline my lips with it really lightly. So. Sometimes I just leave it like this. And I go places with it, and it's just really casual, and it stays on for like a million hours. It's done here. Next is another double-sided lip gloss, and this is a nicer color than that, the other one. I prefer this one. It's like a hot pinkish, and the brush color is really cool. And on the other side is this frosting. See, these don't look the same. This one is more corally and like this one right here, but with sparkles and it's really pretty and it adds a nice effect to the hot pink. And this is my favorite lipstick. I use it every single day. School to work, I don't have work to, to occasions, to the grocery store, to anywhere at home, to friend's house, anywhere. Next is this Blistex fruit smoothie one and I've had this forever and it's really pretty and it smells it smells like a tropical island um and okay it's not broken mm. and it adds a really nice effect to it this is what the blistex looks like and I thought it wouldn't show when I got it but it does and I actually kind of like that next is this hello kitty um, strawberry, strawberry, um, banana smoothie, and I got this from, someone gave it to me, and yeah, my friend gave it to me, and the color's really nice, and it's really sparkly, and it helps my lips a lot, it makes my lips look lighter, and has, like, not cuts on it, it makes my lips look natural. Second last is um, this Paris Nights Liplicious, and this is, I don't know, like, cupcake, grape, it smells, well, I keep on dropping stuff today, Um, it smells really good, and it's purple on my lips, but not like the other lip crayon stuff, looks nice, I don't really wear this a lot, because I don't think about it. But I should. It looks pretty. Last but not least is like my all-time favorite. 
This one um, is glossy, really glossy and gooey. And the brush is so cool. See? The brush is like a paintbrush, and it looks really good on my lips. I put that purple lip crown on, and then I put this on top because it adds such a good flavor and a good showing and a good gloss and glitter, and it just looks super good. Anyways, if you guys have any of these lip lip balms, lip glosses, chapsticks, comment down below and like and subscribe to see more videos of me. And um, next time my brother is coming and he's joining me in a Minecraft video. So stay tuned for that and like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Signing out, Cutie Lou Hannah. Bye.